This video is sponsored by Trugo Republic, the precious metals experts. Talk to one of their experts today about diversifying your portfolio to help assure your future financial security. Find their contact information in the description below and pinned in our first comment. James Kaufman, World News Report today, June 29, 2024. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. We've had a huge film eruption and a coronal mass ejection. Today, June 29, 2024, a filament of magnetism in the sun's southern hemisphere erupted today, June 29, 2024. On its way to space, the plasma-filled strand cut a canyon of fire in the sun's atmosphere. You can see it right here. Unbelievable. The contents of that canyon are now inside a coronal mass ejection, CME, that's headed outbound. We'll actually show you a movie of it on Soho chronographs in just a second. The bulk of the CME should pass south of Earth. However, its flank may deliver a glancing blow on July 2nd. Stay tuned for forecast models from NOAA and Space Weather Prediction Center. This is exactly where the other filament erupted while GOES was out. It's almost a replay, ladies and gentlemen. Let's take a look at the chronomass ejection and the ISWA model. Heading over to LASCO C3, we see the very strong, large chronomass ejection, CME, expelled from the sun with that filament eruption. Ladies and gentlemen, it looks like Earth will be involved with this coronal mass ejection based on the NASA's Isla Goodard spiral. Let's take a look. Now, over to NASA's Goodard Isla spiral. They have modeled the coronal mass ejection as seen here. Earth is the yellow dot here. We've got additional plasma inbound for what looks like the third or fourth. And this looking like it might strike on the third or fourth as well, although Noah called out the second for this. We might be able to better see it here. And you can see the impact there. Let's see, on the third it looks like to me, whereas this is a NASA model, the other models are Noah models. So here we have it, the very large filament eruption and chrome mass ejection which did not show up on GOES, by the way, which is very strange because there's definitely an Earth component based on what NOAA has to say and NASA's Isla Goodard spiral. With that said, God bless you and yours. Look for an impact on the 2nd or 3rd of July. Please share our video. Please subscribe. And always remember, anything's possible in Bizarro World.